Hello my dear friends, welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video we are going to take up one very interesting irrational equation with fifth root and we have to solve for the real values of x. So let's get started straight away with our substitutions. I will call first radicand equal to a power 5, second radicand equal to b power 5. So the very first equation we can write from here, fifth root of a power 5, a fifth root of b power 5, b equal to 1. This is our equation number 1. Now we are going to calculate the value of a power 5 plus b power 5. So a power 5 is 10 square 100 plus 11 over x plus 1 plus b power 5 is again 10 square so we will write 100 plus 11x over x plus 1. 100 plus 100 is 200. Then we have 11 over x plus 1, 11x over x plus 1. So I can take x plus 1 LCM which is common denominator. Then we will write in the numerator 11 plus 11x will be equal to 200 plus 11 is common. So in the bracket we will write 1 plus x in denominator it is x plus 1. Now x plus 1, 1 plus x will be over. We will write here 200 plus 11 only. So second equation would be a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 211. So we have to solve this new system of equations a plus b equal to 1 a power 5 plus b power 5 is 211. Let's solve. I will use binomial expansion. So I need to expand a plus b whole power 5. I will use Pascal triangle also. Let us find out the eligible coefficients for power 5. So for power 2, 1, 2, 1. For power 3, 1, 3, 3, 1. For power 4, 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. And for required power 5, 1, 5, 10, 10, 5, 1. Now I will club first and last 1 all together. Second and second last 5 all together. And 10 and 10 will combine all together. And write a power 5 plus b power 5. Plus 5 times ab in the bracket a cube plus b cube plus 10 times a square b square a plus b. Now we have two known equations. Equation 1 a plus b equal to 1. Equation 2 a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 211. But a cube plus b cube is not known. So we can use algebraic formula a cube plus b cube. This is equal to a plus b whole cube minus 3 times a b a plus b. Now we know a plus b is 1. So we can write 1 cube minus 3 a b times 1. So I can write 1 minus 3 a b is the value of a cube plus b cube which we will apply here. So I can write our equation a plus b is 1. So 1 power 5 would be our LHS. RHS a power 5 plus b power 5 equation number 2. We will write 211 plus 5ab a cube plus b cube 1 minus 3ab plus 10 a square b square a plus b is 1. This is 1. Now we have to simplify. 1 power 5 is 1. I will take 211 to the LHS. So it will be minus 211. RHS will be equal to 5 ab in bracket 1 minus 3 ab plus 10 times a square b square. 1 minus 211 minus 210. RHS will be 5ab times 1, 5ab. 
फाइव ए बी टाइम्स माइनस थ्री बी माइनस फिफ्टीन ए स्क्वायर बी स्क्वायर प्लस टेन ए स्क्वायर बी स्क्वायर वी कैन डायरेक्टली राइट माइनस फाइव ए स्क्वायर बी स्क्वायर ना इक्वेशन इज डिविजल बाई फाइव सो वी विल डिवाइड बोथ साइड बाई फाइव We will write minus forty two equal to a b minus a square b square minus forty two equal to a b minus a square b square. Take all the terms to left hand side. We will get one quadratic in a b a square b square minus a b minus forty two equal to zero. Now we will use method of factorization. So I will write a square b square minus ab. I can split minus seven ab plus six ab. Addition will be minus ab. If I will multiply, I will get product minus forty two a square b square, which is matching minus forty two equal to zero. Now ab is common from first two terms. We will get ab minus seven in the bracket. Six is common from last two terms. We will get AB minus seven in the bracket. RHS is zero. Now we have factorization. AB minus seven times AB plus six equal to zero. We can use product zero rule and write either AB minus seven equal to zero. So we will get AB equal to seven. Or AB plus six equal to zero, we will get AB equal to negative six. Now I will write our first equation A plus B equal to one. From there, we will calculate the value of B in terms of A, one minus A, and this value we are going to apply here. So I can write A times one minus A. This is equal to seven minus six. Or a minus a square will be equal to seven. Will be equal to minus six. Now take all the terms to RHS. We will get two quadratic equations. So I can write here a square minus a plus seven equal to zero. Our first quadratic equation. And second equation would be a square minus a minus six equal to zero. So we have to solve both the equations. Let's begin with the first one. A square minus a plus seven equal to zero. Just check discriminant value. So I will write here b square minus four ac. This is discriminant for quadratic equation. So I can write here b is minus one, so minus one a square minus four times. A is coefficient of small a square one. C is constant seven. Minus one a square is one. Minus four times seven is twenty eight. So we are getting discriminant minus twenty seven. Discriminant is coming out negative. We will conclude. We are going to get complex solutions. So we have to reject. This quadratic equation, as we are looking for reals only. Now I will write our second equation: a square minus a minus six equal to zero. Again, we will use factorization method. We can split minus a as minus three a plus two a minus six equal to zero. Now from first two terms, a is common, so a minus three. Will be in the bracket from last two. Two is common. A minus three will be in the bracket equal to zero. So we can write factorization a plus two times a minus three equal to zero. So from here I can write either a equal to three or a equal to negative two. So we have two a values. Which we are going to accept a equal to three and a equal to negative two. Now, if you remember, our substitution was here. See, a power five is ten square plus eleven over x plus one. This was a power five. 
so we need to find out a power 5 first so i will write 3 power 5 and minus 2 power 5 now 3 power 5 is 81 times 3 243 minus 2 power 5 is minus 32 now this is a power 5 now i will write 10 is square plus 11 over x plus 1 this is a power 5 equal to 243 and minus 32 now i will subtract 100 from both the sides so let me write here minus 100 here also minus 100 minus 100 so 10 square is 100 minus 100 will be over now we can write here LHS 11 over X plus 1. RHS will be 243 minus 100. 143 and minus 32 minus 100 minus 132. Now I will divide our equation by 11 first. So let me write here 11 in the denominator. We will write 11 in the denominator here also. 11. Now we will cancel 11 and 11 from LHS. I will write 1 over x plus 1. This will be equal to 13 and minus 12. Now we have to only consider reciprocal both sides. Let me write here 1 over x plus 1 equal to 13 and negative 12. Now we will switch numerator and denominator, both sides. So here denominator is 1. Now we will switch. So LHS will become x plus 1. RHS will be 1 over 13 and 1 over 12 with negative sign. Now we have to subtract 1 from both the sides. So I will write here minus 1, this side also minus 1, this side also minus 1. This plus and minus 1 will be over. We will write LHS x. Then here we will be writing 1 over 13 minus 1. And then we will write minus 1 over 12 minus 1. Now we have to take LCM. We will get our answers. So x will be equal to 1 minus 13 over 13 which is minus 12 over 13. Minus 1 minus 12 over 12. So, minus 13 over 12. So, we have two real solutions. Negative 12 over 13 and negative 13 over 12. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.